Example 2. For f of x is equal to x to the fourth minus 2x squared plus 2, we want to determine the horizontal tangents points. So what we need to do is right away we see the word tangent, so we know we're going to take a derivative, and we want to find the horizontal tangents. So step one is to take the derivative. So we have f of x is equal to x to the fourth minus 2x squared plus 2. So f prime of x is 4x cubed minus 4x plus 0 because it's a constant. So step 2 is to set f prime of x equal to 0. Why you might ask set it equal to 0? Since f prime of x is the slope of the tangent line and horizontal lines have a slope of 0. So before we solve this algebraically, I first want to show you what the graph of this looks like so we can understand what we're actually looking at. And so here we're going to take a look at our graph, which is x to the fourth minus 2x squared plus 2. And we're going to just look to see how many horizontal tangents we should have. So as I move a back and forth, we see we get 1, 2, and 3. And if I zoom out, we can see that it won't become horizontal again. So I should have 1, 2, and 3 horizontal tangents. And we can see that when we have a horizontal tangent, the slope of this tangent line is 0. So now we're going to go ahead and set the derivative equal to 0 and solve. So we get 0 is equal to 4x cubed minus 4x. And so now we just solve. All right, so we get x is equal to 0 and x is equal to plus or minus 1. So now to find the actual coordinates, I have to plug those x values back into my original equation. So we have our equation as f of x is equal to x to the fourth minus 2x squared plus 2. So f of 0 is just going to be 2. f of 1 you get 1, and f of negative 1, you get 1 as well. So now we can write our answer. The curve has horizontal tangents at x equals 0, x equals 1, and x equals negative 1. And if we really wanted to write out the coordinates, we could say it has horizontal tangents at 0, 2, negative 1, 1, and 1, 1. So now on your own, I want you to try to determine the horizontal tangents of y equals x cubed plus 5 halves x squared plus 2x minus 1. And I want you to determine the values of x where a horizontal tangent exists. All right, here we go. We have y is equal to x cubed plus 5 halves x squared plus 2x minus 1. And we need to take the derivative with respect to x to from both sides. So we get y is equal to 3x squared plus 10 halves x plus 2. So, sorry, it should be dy dx. dy dx is equal to 3x squared plus 5x plus 2. And now we just have to solve that out. So we set it equal to 0 is equal to 3x squared plus 5x plus 2. And now what you want to do is go ahead and plug these x values into your original function to find the coordinates. And so you get the coordinates negative 2 thirds, comma, negative 41 over 27. And then you plug in negative 1.
And so you end up getting the coordinates negative 1, negative 3 halves. So these are your two answers.